Well, I got started in college. Um, I was 21 and I was on a track team in college. I uh, ran track and then also I had two part time jobs and I was a double major. And uh, I personally was looking for something different because I had a lot, I like to tell people, I had, even though I had two jobs, I still had more money than I had money. And so I actually was looking for something that didn't have a cap. Uh, I, I've always been a hard worker. I just was in the wrong vehicle. And then one day I got a call from one of my teammates. He said him and my him and another teammate were doing something. And I may be interested. I may not. And I, I said, okay, I, I'm all ears. I thought they were going to tell me over the phone. But they asked me to come sit down. And i never forget that day we sat uh, at my friend's house. And it was pretty awesome because I was like, hey, I sign me up right now. Hey, well. What I realized a long time ago is nobody's going to pay my bills for me. Nobody was going to pay my bills. Nobody was going to have to, nobody was going to come and live my body and, and live in my body and say, Hey, I take care of all your worries. I'm going to make it. No, it doesn't work like that. You know, people are going to give you their opinion and then guess what? They're still going to go live their life and hope you take their advice. And I learned a long time ago also, you can't take advice from somebody you wouldn't switch places from, mm. regardless of who it was. Yeah, I've been rejected several times. Uh, people, again, thought I was crazy. And I used to get mad. I used to be like, why? What? I used to try to try to convince somebody, and then I used to be like, it doesn't work. Because if I convince you and have to force you in, then I'm always have to carry you and, and pull you around. And I'm not that big of a guy, so... Me trying to carry people is not going to work. Uh, but what I learned also is your team and the people that's behind you are going to do what you do. So if you're in creating build mode, which you should always be in creating build mode majority of the year, is that's where your team is going to do. So if they see you bringing in people and, uh, you know, getting congratulated on bringing in new people and different things, eventually it's going to look at them and they're going to be like, you know what? Maybe maybe I should do it. Uh, it's been so many times where if I catch myself in management mode, I was like, hey, there's nothing that three to four new people won't do to elevate. And then also, uh, it also inspires the team to say, hey, you will. And just got three to four new people. Let's go get three to four new people. The last few words I would say is, hey, now is the time to go make it happen, you guys. What happened the last year? Um, it doesn't matter all that. What happened in previous years, we all got a clean slate. We're a half, over a half a billion dollar startup company. And guess what? The owners have a vision. The corporate has their vision of where they want to be at. Where, I know, Allison, you have a vision of where you want Canada to be at. And just like you and Rick have a vision of where you want North America to be at. And then the owners have a vision of where they want the world to be at. And so... It's going to be this big old pie that it's enough for everybody to get some. So the question I can always ask everybody is how much of the piece of the pie do you want? What piece? Do you want a small piece? Do you want a big piece? Do you want an extremely big piece? Because the vision is, hey, whatever you think you can, you can do 10 times more than what you think you can. All you got to do is just start. Simply start. You got to simply start. Today is the day. Uh, you know, Write out your goals. Write out your vision tonight. Put it everywhere that you go, refrigerator, bathroom, put in the visor on your car, put in your notebooks, put in your favorite book that you read, put it in your Bible, put it with, you know, and, and just and just go and just go for it and just put in the work. Get out of the management mode, get out of the lazy mode and just go get in creating mode, creating build mode and go for it.